I think this is interesting. So, Ye's hanging out with Milo Yelanopoulos. Um, he's like this gay, white, conservative. Um, what can I say about him? I like that he has an opinion. Um, I think that there's probably philosophically like a lot that Ye and Milo agree on. I think there's some stuff, um, I don't know, it was kind of strange. I think Milo didn't understand a lot of, I don't want to say like the black experience, because he was kind of like some of the stuff that he said was basically like he was opposed to like affirmative action and he started giving, I, I think some shit he was just saying though to kind of, almost for clickbait. I don't know if he really felt that way because he's dated most of his boyfriends are black uh but that's not the point here um yeah i don't know i think that they probably have some very interesting conversations i think there's probably a lot a lot that they agree on um like cancel culture like they both have been publicly canceled in this way uh and I don't know, like, uh, in terms of conservative principles and values, a lot of what Kanye or Ye has said, <coughs> excuse me, does align with what um, Mila Milo believes. Um, so I think it makes sense that they are friends or talking or whatever. What I feel like, yeah, they probably have, like, a lot to talk about, a lot that they could agree on and find a similar struggle um to be honest i really think that more people should just have conversations with people who are different than them like that's it's really important like you can't just be around one point of view um you just have to be exposed to like all perspectives um you don't have to agree with them but it does make sense to try to understand them